Hi, everyone. Done with all the books now. Ow, ow, ow. That's finally done. Well, kind of. This part here, I still need to fix, but that one's good, and then this one's done. I still have to fix this area. I still have to fix these these books right here underneath my desk. So. So late January, I started teaching myself how to tattoo. I actually owned a coil machine, a couple of them for years. I mean, we're talking decades and I never did anything with them. I've always loved the craft of tattooing and I was always interested to learn. But for some reason, I just, you know, I got distracted and eventually I just forgot about it. After suffering a serious existential crisis late last year, I finally decided to give it a try. You see me here testing it out on fake skin. This is one of the first practices I, I did. It was awful, but I think I'm getting better, maybe. So yeah, I did swap my old coil machine for a wireless pen. So expect to see a bit more of this on the channel.
So this is my current tattoo practice setup. I've gotten a lot more comfortable using the tattoo machine after about a month or so of practice. And right now I'm learning to get more comfortable tattooing on a curved surface. So I'm simulating, I guess, curves on a, on a soft um, pillow that I found, <laughs> headrest actually, that I found here at the house. So yeah, that's this is currently the setup that I'm trying to get used to. I'm still far from tattooing human skin, obviously, like so, so far. But honestly, I did sneak in a tiny little tattoo on my ankle just to see how much pain I can tolerate. And it's, it's okay. It's okay. I might actually end up tattooing myself in the future. Maybe I'll record it if you want to see it. So, yeah. exercising and workout and then I'm gonna go take a walk so yeah happy Tuesday <laughs>
I've been working a lot on my sketchbook lately. The past few weeks, I've been consistently opening it and trying to paint a drawing or painting or do a painting at least uh, almost every day. For this particular image, I'm using an old Japan trip photo that I got. And it's a way for me to hype myself up since I can't travel yet, not until late this year, so.
Can you feel that intense summer heat? I can. Anyway, thank you so much for joining me on this week's video and see you next time. Bye.